Hey, what are you doing in my car? What's going on? Hide me. What? You just saved my life. Thank you. What's going on? Who are you? I, I don't have time to explain. Goodbye. Thank you. Uh, wait. Uh My life has been a series of tragic twists and turns, but I had no idea that meeting that man would have changed my life forever. My name is Sarah, and this is the story of how I gained my freedom back. Who was she? Come in. Hey, Penelope. Hey. Just dropping off this quarter's fiscal report. Um, I need you to double check and make sure everything's right. Can do. Uh, and when we're done here, you want to go get some dinner? An employee taking his boss to dinner? Shouldn't it be the other way around? My treat? Okay, I'll see you after work. You again. I wanted to thank you for earlier. You didn't tell me what was going on. Are you in danger? What's going on? Um, well. <laughs> uh, please don't. Relax. It's probably just my boss. <laughs> uh, can I help you? Yes, as a matter of fact. You know. I was in the area, and I'm wondering, have you seen a young woman running around here by any chance? She's uh, about 5'2"-ish, blonde, brown eyes. Um. <laughs> I'm assuming not, because you uh, seem a little preoccupied with that one chick in the car. Did you know her? Uh, yeah. She's my girlfriend. We both work in this office park, and we I'd like to say goodbye in the morning. Well, certainly very entertaining. Anyways, here's my number. If you see anything, you just give me a call and you let me know. It's very important that I find her. All right? She's a threat to herself and others. What do you mean? Hopefully you don't find out. Have a good day. Okay. You have five seconds to explain. Oh, okay, okay. Um, my name is Sarah. That man's Daniel. He's my captor. What? I come from a pretty rough background. My parents died when I was young, and I've been in and out of foster care until I became too old. I was out in the streets until a very wealthy man picked me up and took me in. He cleaned me up and gave me everything I could ever want. But as soon as I let my guard down, his true self emerged. When I realized enough is enough, I left him and have been on the run ever since. Oh my God. I'm so sorry. Why are you sorry? If anything, I should be sorry I even brought you into this mess. I'm so sorry that happened to you. It, look, you can stay here in my office for now. I'll, I'll get you some snacks and, and then we'll figure out what to do next. My name's Michael, by the way. I'll be right back. I've never experienced such kindness. Hey! Hey! Are you okay? You seem a little nervous. Yeah, I'm fine. Just got a lot on my mind. Okay, well, hopefully that won't interfere with our dinner plans later. No, 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 I'm uh, actually really looking forward to that. 
I'm just uh, getting some snacks. I didn't have lunch. Oh. See you tonight. See you then. Something is up with him. Here. Thank you. So, do you have anyone that you might be potentially reunited with? I'm not sure. I used to be in foster care, but no one came looking for me. There's a reason why I became homeless. I don't understand how no one came looking for you. The only thing I have for my family is my mom's necklace. And, it, where is it? God. You, uh, left it in my car. Oh. You have no idea how much this means to me. Hey, uh, I'm gonna be right back. Okay. Uh, who are you? Um, I'm uh, Michael's friend. Oh, that's nice. Annie's hiding here during business hours. Oh, please. Um, I'll be gone by the end of the day. You'll be gone quicker when I call security. Penelope? Uh, what's going on? Who is she? She's a friend, and she needed my help. That's all. Fine, but the next time you bring unauthorized people in here, at least let me know first. I'm sorry. Can I use the bathroom? Uh, yeah, of course. Uh, down the hall on the right. Penelope, you don't even know what's going on. Yes, I do. I saw the number that was left on your desk and I called it. And Daniel said that she escaped from a psych ward. She's insane and dangerous. She is not. It's not true. Really? Did you even question her? You've known her for what, a couple hours? How do you know what her intentions are? Yeah, I took a big risk bringing her into this office. And no, I don't know her. But Penelope, her whole situation sounds wrong. You could be right, but I can't take the chance of you being wrong, okay? If you leave this office, you're out of a job. What's well, a risk I'm willing to take? <sighs> hey! Let go of her! Not a matter that concerns you. Go now! <laughs> 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 Let's go. Let's go. Come on. We made it. Michael. Sit. My life has been a series of tragic twists and turns. For the first time in my life, I met someone who showed me dignity and respect. When the knife hit him, I thought I would be all alone again. Thankfully, he survived. Are you ready? Ready. And now my tragic life finally has something in it that it was missing. Love. <laughs>